Students spend a week during a week falling in love with rice, falling in love with the traditions, their college, this campus, their classmates. I just want to take you across the street. We're build a garden. We have the really unique opportunity at the Center for Civic Leadership, the CCL, to introduce them and inevitably allow them to fall in love in the very same way with Houston communities. Houston and Rice University, we do have a problem and that problem today is food insecurity. So today at Outreach Day we have over 350 students going to five different uh, community organizations working on everything from community gardens to senior meal packaging. We hope this opportunity and the focus that we've created with Hunger and Food Insecurity will allow them to have a similar experience and a similar dialogue that they can bring back to campus and engage for the next four years at Rice. Rip it out. Rip it out. We want soil. We see today not as one day of service, but as day one of students' engagement with the Houston community. In order to like really experience Houston, you really need to get out and experience all these different things that we can do to serve our people here. Food insecurity is something that kind of forms the basis of all needs of humans. There's this concept called Maslow's Hierarchy of Needs. It's a psychological term and basically it's five different things that all humans need and the lowest possible form is food. So people cannot be hungry um, in order for them to actually be able to think. And so I think food insecurity is the best way for us to understand the experiences of people and to build those long-lasting connections. I was like blown away. It's like the most competitive volunteering I've ever seen in my life. Rice students are very driven. Most, most of them you have to be to get into Rice to be able to thrive there. But as soon as we were told about the um, assembly line being timed, everyone just really jumped in. Everyone was really enthusiastic and it's like everyone's having a lot of fun. And it's nice to see that you can have fun with your peers, especially what people think of stereotypical fun for college students is not usually volunteering at a food bank. It's really wonderful to see that. I think Rice University has been a, a, a great partner with us in the Fifth Ward community by bringing the students out here to work. One, it gives the students another um, a light to see that that's in Houston, Texas, you know, from a vantage point that some of the students may not have seen. Also, it gives us, in the community, uh, students here to help us to do some of the things that we have to do. So, right, part, my, my organization partnering up with Rice University is a great opportunity for great things to happen in the Fifth Ward community. I kind of want to come back here again. This is like my sort of thing anyway. So, like, back here, help them out, like, make it more than just like a one-term thing where, like, I signed up because they asked me to and like came back here because I recognize the name like I actually want to come back here and like make it like a long-term volunteer effort. Yeah, it can be hard as an outsider to come in and have an impact and you really have to evaluate the reasons that you're doing the service. Are you doing it because you think that you can come in and help these people or are you doing it because you want to be a part of the community? Like for me, I'm, I just want to feel like I'm a part of Houston. I want to have some sort of investment in the community that I don't have yet. So you can always keep doing more, I think. And you should do more. Everyone should, I think.